Hi there. My name is Jenna. This is 1111 with Jenna. I'm here seven days, seven nights, 14 times a week, and I'm having a little uh, technical difficulty. Not really, but kind of. My phone had some, some kind of spyware, malware, something tonight, and I had to go and clear everything and re-upload and William D. Lindeman. Hello there, sir. Hello, William D. How are you? So yeah, that was a ride. Every time my phone would, it would just stop working and I couldn't turn it on, but it would, I couldn't turn it off. I couldn't even do a hard stop or a hard close. And anyway, Julie Roos. Julie, Julie, Julie. Yes, I'm going public right now. Edited privacy. We're back at it. Back and better than ever. Hello, Mr. William Dietrich. Tuesday. Are you available? Tuesday. This coming up Tuesday. Tuesday, April 12th. Let's talk. Patty Loman. Hello, Patty Loman. Patty Loman. That was really funny. Patty sent me a, a really interesting, well, some other kind of spam. But, ah, oh, William D is great. Hey, Tammy. I just want to let everybody know that you can share the show. And if you feel like Sharing a generous gift, you can go to Venmo or PayPal or Patreon or P.O. Box. And I have Zelle. That's true. It's true. It's all true. It's really, really true. A couple of you on here I don't know, but hello. My name is Jenna. I'm here every day at 11, 11 a.m. and 11, 11 p.m. Eastern Time. Mama Grace in the house. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We will be going to... Where are we going, Patty, on Tuesday? I forget. Barrington? Is that it? Is it Barrington? Something like that. Illinois. Illinois. We'll be going to Illinois. Like people call St. Joseph, they call it St. Joe's. Hi, Patty Loman. I'm excited. Yeah. Core group, core group. What did I write down here? Oh, function. Barrington, I was gonna say that. We will be going to Barrington Hills near Palatine on Tuesday. Okay? Close to the airport, but not to the airport. Anyway, it's Tuesday night. Missing Andy Raider, who used to be here, and now I'm trying to find out something creative to talk about. But I do want to talk about something that I lightly talked about this morning. Um, Jean Piero Scuderi, who has been on sh the show many times, who created the music for the show, um, such as this. standing ovation on that. <laughs> Died yesterday. And I didn't know him really well, but he was a dear, dear friend of Dave and Ruth Love. And because of 1111 with Jenna and Dave being so interested in helping make this happen, he asked Jean Piero to be a part of the music. And 
he was. And then he was a part of um, Corona Roki. Hey, Rob Morocco. He performed on Corona Roki when, when we first, it was, let's just have some music. And then I remember being somewhere and Dave calling me and going, how about we do something cool like, like karaoke on Thursday nights? And then, you know, one thing led to another and it was Corona Roki and then one thing led to another and there was music. And Jean Piero was a big part of it. And then he became a performer on Corona Roki. And as it goes on Community and Connection with 1111 with Jenna, he and I became good friends and we actually talked about a project together and he died yesterday. And it was a complete and sudden shock. I mean, I'd never been in the same room with him and that's how I feel about everybody that's here. You know, most of us have never, I've been in the same room with Patty. I've been in the same room with, well, William, I don't know if we've, oh, we've been in a room. We've been at the college. We've been outside together a lot. Um, but I've said this before in interviews, I have spent two years with people that I've never been in the same room with that I know of, that I'll be friends with for the rest of my life. And I know that there are people here that have made connections with each other outside of the show. And I made a strong connection with Jean Piero and he died yesterday and his daughter posted that he was really, it was really nice. If you go to his page, I can even, I'll just put his name. I don't want to go. Hmm. I'm not sure why it won't highlight, but if you go to that, if you spell that out and go to his page, I know I'm spelling it right. Um, you can meet, you can read. There it is. Jean. Yeah, that's how I spelled it. But his daughter, my wonderful, ethereal, angelic, amazing father has passed away. And his page is full of beautiful stories about him. It's, it's mind bending when someone leaves and apparently he'd been sick. I don't know for how long or what, but he had a lot of really great experiences with all these people. So I just knew him through, from here. And this is another reason why it makes me so grateful that we started this magical mystery of 1111 with Jenna. So take a minute and listen to his music and honor him, my wonderful they they have a, a, a um, I can read this really quick. Jean Piero was born in Rome, Italy, on October twenty third. We knew that, nineteen fifty seven. He fell in love with music and decided to move to America in the eighties to pursue his dreams. Jean Piero was a self taught musician who played the guitar, saxophone, drums, and piano along with many other instruments. He passed away after a battle with liver cancer. Jean Piero is survived by his daughter, Alessandra Scuderi, his son, Adriano, and the mother of his children, Stephanie Parks. He was a loving father and an extremely talented musician. Jean Piero's love and passion for love, for music, will forever allow his memory to live on and his soul to touch others. Jean Piero was a kind, compassionate, and open-minded soul who positively impacted anyone he came in contact with. Jean Piero also had a passion for cooking Along with staying true to his Italian heritage, Jean Piero was a true intellectual who could charm anyone with his witty humor, that's for sure. Jean Piero did not have medical insurance and his family has a lot of medical expenses they have to pay for. This is a GoFundMe to help pay, 
help his family pay for his medical expenses, memorial expenses, and other bills that come up. And so they've created a GoFundMe page on the Facebook page. I don't really have, yeah, really sad. And it's, it's nothing I've ever thought about, but, you know. But it's a pretty strong community that's been created here. And like I said, never been in the same room with him, but we were all with him at a, a strange time in our lives. So... On that note, like I said, check out his music. I know he had quite a bit on, let's see. I bet, William, you're going to find something before I do, but I'm looking. I just enjoyed, oh, here's one, Over the Hills and Far Away. A flamenco tribute to Led Zeppelin. I post it and you can check it out. So on that note. Hi, Bonnie Barker. And my sister and Katie said goodbye to Andy Flanders today after 21 years of being on the planet. Cute, 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 cute. sweet, smart, kitty cat. He and Lillian kind of look, well, they did look alike. Yeah, real hard, right? So I think that I am going to suggest that and why does that do that, William? I want to do that. That's not what I wanted to do. I'll post another file. Drawing. Oh, here it is. Okay. I think I'm going to say goodnight. Copying it and pasting it and hard, right? So I think that I there it is. Hi, Linda Siriano. Ah, oh, yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. Stay safe, stay healthy, be real nice. Great thoughts grand words, and a gigantic heart. Huge hug, everybody. And another one. A heart hug, too. Everyone, give yourselves a heart hug. And I'm going to go hug my mama and Lillian Pearl. Love hard. Really.